I would describe working in kitchens with my experience as being more like a pirate ship. It's like there aren't any rules. There's a lot of tension, there's a lot of conflict. It's just, it's more rough in the back. At the very beginning, I was the only girl in the kitchen. Like they didn't teach that in culinary school. Well, you can imagine the culture shock, people with foul mouths and like kicking chairs over and things like that. <laughs> If you can make hot food, it goes out on time, it's plated perfectly, like everybody kind of looks the other way. I had been so fed up with how much I'd had to deal with in restaurants that I was just done. I had enough. Speed comes with practice. The more you practice, the faster you become. My next step is to open a restaurant. It's always a miracle to take us like vision and to pay for it all. I got the sense that everybody was trying to scare me away from doing it. And all that did was push me to want it more. To, uh, to do what she's done, to sacrifice what she's left behind, brilliant. They're like, you're the boss. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I am, aren't I? Cheers to that. <laughs> yeah. Cheers to that. Thank you, Lord. We do uh, come before you and give you honor and glory for your goodness and mercy to us. Lord, we thank you for this wonderful food that Karin has prepared and for the fellowship around this table. <laughs> restaurant, you know? <laughs>